In a previous video, we looked at the recording script functionality using retopple primitives, and we'll now attempt to do the same with sculpt primitives. As in the previous video, I went to the scripts menu and chose record script before beginning any work. Here, I'm just creating a simple cube, flattening it, and then I chose apply to commit it to the scene. And now I'm going to attempt to create some legs. I could use symmetry to quickly create these, but I think it's just as quick for demonstration purposes to click to place for individual legs. And then I'll hit apply to commit those as well. Next, I'll select a few different primitives to place on top of this platform. One thing I should mention to new users is that what I'm seeing right now in gray is a preview object. It's not yet committed to the scene. So always keep that in mind. You have to hit apply or the enter key to commit it to the selected sculpture layer. Now we want to go to the scripts menu and choose stop recording script. We can now go to the scripts directory and observe that it has indeed created the script file. Now let's go to the scripts menu and choose run script. Locate the file and then choose to open it. We can see that it has indeed repeated all the steps that we previously made to create the scene. Now we can go back to the script file, modify a few parameters within the script itself, and see that reflected when we open it once again in a text editor. We will make a few adjustments and then test the result. Once we are done with our modifications, we can save the file, then go back to the scripts menu and choose to run the script. And we can observe a successful result of all the changes that we made within the script itself. With that, we will conclude this demonstration. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.